Fellow alchemists, welcome back to our series on Kathy. Now, there's something I want to show you guys is that uh, when you go into Kathy, of course, you have your uh, default setup. And if I go to here, let me see if I try to create a post. So let me just reload my environment. So if I go in here, uh, I can actually create a post just fine. But let's say instead of it saying publish with a check mark, if I wanted to actually change that to be just a simple drop down, we can actually do that. We can change around how this form actually works. And we can actually hide this publishing uh, also from our creation different than our editing. I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. So there is a simple function you call form fields. And just like above, it'll return a key list, keyword list. So say we title, we can be no, sorry, new. Go back over here, you'll see we just have the title over here, show and hide things, body new, this use the default, published, new. We have over that, and I said that we can actually change this so that it becomes a drop down. And so if you use a map and you use choices, and of course you give it a list of choices with tuples. So this is gonna be the label, so published. And of course the value will be true. And then we do the same thing over here, maybe unpublish. And the value will be false. So now if we go back, you'll see now we actually have a dropdown, which is just, just nice. Now let's say that every time you create a post, the, the default will always be unpublished, right? Or not published. Well, what we can do is we can actually hide that upon creation and we just accept the default value. So then what we can do is we can say, when we create, we want this to be hidden. Oh, sorry. This one's not part of here. It's part of here. So when you create, it's going to be hidden. <clears throat> so then when I say, uh, okay, new title, new body, and I go to save, or I can just say save and continue editing. Now it's already been created, right? <clears throat> so here's our title and our body. And now we can actually unpublish or publish it. So I can say, okay, let's publish it. And there we go. It's actually published. So this is how you can start to edit things. And what you can also do is within your form field, say you don't really know what actually is publishing. So then what you can say over here is you can add some help text. You could say uh, something like get set to published article, sorry, post will be published immediately. So this is a simple help text, and you'll see the help text gets put over here so people understand what that actually means. And also, uh, we can also change the label too. So label, maybe published with a question mark so people know it's kind of a Boolean. can do that but it seems to not be working over here but anyways uh, you can see over here the, the publishing with help text should be working just fine so these people can get an idea of what it actually, what it actually is so that's how you can change uh, your form if you'd like to have things differently you can show and hide things per you know creating or updating uh, any kind of thing like that so this is Alan from Plangora please subscribe if you haven't and otherwise, I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks. Bye. Hi. Please feel free to ask us any questions about Elixir, Flutter, or anything else in programming. Here's our YouTube channel, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. We'll answer your questions every Friday. Ya mantai, ge duk man all. Yo wenti, ji da wen wo.